One time, Kristen, thank you. First Lord, now, believe it or not, it's almost time to head back to school. Crazy that we're saying that. Aisha's at the First Lord Safety Desk and an important reminder this morning for parents and college students, Aisha, we're talking about fire safe college housing. We are, Emerson. Just saying this from Appleton Fire Officials, this message today, never sign a student housing lease until you've seen the dorm, house, or apartment, fire officials say. For most students, the last fire safety training they received was in grade school, but with new independence comes new responsibilities. There's this great checklist right here. It's from the Appleton Fire Department. They shared it, but it's actually from the U.S. Fire Administration. So important if you can read through this, but we have some of the highlights for you this morning right here on your screen. What you need to look out for first and foremost, are there working smoke alarms in each bedroom? outside of sleeping areas and on each level of the building. Check for that. Also, are there at least two ways out of each room and the building? In addition to that, do the upper levels of the building have at least two sets of stairs inside and or a fire escape? Really important. And are there exit signs in the hallways to show the way out? Also, are there enough electrical outlets for all those appliances our college students use? Computers, printers, electronics, without using an extension cord. That part's really important as well. And we'll have a link to all of this at WBAY.com under the safety desk tab. Fire officials have this checklist, but also some really important <coughs> safety material, including alcohol and fire safety together, cooking and electrical safety, and lots more information that can be life-saving, Emerson. Aisha.